This screencast will cover the process of rebranding the client UI. First we will open this client called WinSCP. This is an SCP client for Windows that I use to transfer files via SFTP onto our Linux server. So first I will connect up to the server that OpenVPNAS is installed on. Accept the key. Give it a sec for it to connect. All right, we are connected. I will browse over to the user directory. User, local, OpenVPNAS. We will go into the etc. directory, etc. We will then go and open and edit the as.com file. Okay. Now that we are in the as.com file, you will see this area right here where it says the company name will be shown. And you will change this area right here where it says OpenVPN Technologies Inc. You will change it to your company name or whatever you would like it to say um, in the text on the client UI. I will do company name example. And then you also want to add another line and this will go to your image or to your company logo and I will do it this way user local open VPN AS ETC and you will save that and then I will go ahead and exit out of here and I will find my logo which I have put on my desktop called logo.png and as you can see, we're already in the ETC directory. I will now transfer over logo.png. And let me go back and double check in my as.conf that I named it logo.png. So I put etc slash logo.png click save I then open up my putty window and go to my host OS that hosts the open access server log in with root credentials and give it a sec to log in here we're running a machine with low memory I will then do a command to restart OpenVPNAS Service OpenVPNAS restart, and it'll give the status that it's restarting OpenVPNAS. Okay, it's been restarted. We will now navigate over to our client UI. This is what it looked like before. This is what it looks like now. This is my company logo. As you can see. It's reading the logo and the text right here, company name example. This concludes the screencast of rebranding the client UI. I will talk to you in support.